Hi, this is Derek with Maple Systems. In this video, I will be doing an overview of Maple Systems Mapware 7000 software, the programming software for Maple Systems PLCs and HMI PLC combo units. This is free software that can be downloaded from Maple Systems website. I currently have opened the demo project for the 4101, the 10 inch screen in the Maple Systems HMC 4000 series. You can see the different components of the project in the project information window in what is called the project tree. Base screens can be created by right clicking on the base screens folder and selecting new base screen. Selecting an existing base screen will display it in the main window. All screen objects are accessible from the drop down menus in the top toolbar. Some of the objects available are quick buttons which are objects with a pre-programmed task assigned to them data editing objects such as bit entry and numeric entry objects for modifying the contents of a register, as well as advanced objects such as task buttons, bar graphs, trend displays, and alarm displays. Double clicking on an object will display its properties in the right window. Pop-up screens are temporary windows that can be triggered to appear over the top of a base screen. These are similar to keypads which are used for data entry. These keypads will appear when a user interacts with a numeric or ASCII entry object on the screen. Templates are screens that can be created and used as a background for a base screen. Multiple template screens can be stacked on a base screen. This is a great advantage when creating many base screens that are similar to each other but have only slight changes. Email is a feature that is specific to the HMC 4000 series. You can configure the server from which an email will be sent, as well as create groups of contacts. When an email is triggered, a screenshot of a specific email screen will be sent. All of the HMC models can be configured as an FTP client to send a data log file to an FTP server. In order to use this feature, the data logger must be configured. The HMC 4000 series are unique in that they can be configured as an FTP host where data will reside on a USB drive or SD card connected to the HMC. MQTT is also a feature for the HMC 4000 series. You can configure an external broker, such as the public Mosquito Broker. You can choose topics to publish to, as well as topics to subscribe to. In Mapware 7000, the Logic Blocks folder stores the control logic for the application. Mapware uses the IEC programming standard, which includes a standard function block library, as well as five programming languages, including ladder logic and structured text. In the IEC programming mode, there are five different types of control logic blocks. The power up logic blocks will run once when the unit is powered on, and will run before any other logic blocks. Because of this, tags can be assigned initial values in a power up logic block. The main logic blocks are the core of the application. The logic in these blocks will run continuously until power is terminated to the unit. Subroutines can be used to organize logic into smaller blocks then be reused. A subroutine can be called from a main block. When the subroutine is finished, the program will pick up where it left off. A timer interrupt is a block of logic that is run periodically. This logic has the highest priority and will interrupt the current process. Mapware enables the user to define their own function blocks. This is great for programmers who want to make their own custom functions to supplement the standard function block library. Mapware 7000 is the software used to configure the I.O. modules that are connected to the base unit. This is where you can configure the type of analog signal that will be read or set up PWM. The data window allows the values of tags to be viewed in real time while online. Right click on the screen to add any tag in the tag database to this window. Tasks are simple processes that are run in the background. Typically, they are operations such as incrementing a value or moving a value from one tag to another. Power on tasks run once while the unit is powered on. A power on task can be created to initialize a tag in your application. Global tasks or processes that are run in a constant loop in the background. The tag database contains all the tags in the project. Tags can be created or modified 
in the tag database. In the tag editor, there are a variety of data types you can select. You can choose whether or not you want the tag to be global, retentive, or local to a specific logic block. You can also choose if this tag will publish or subscribe to an MQTT topic. Under the Network Configuration folder, you can add communication drivers to your project. You can select the COM port on which the driver will be configured. COM1 and 2 are for serial communication, and COM3 is for Ethernet. Right-click on the COM port folder and select Add to open the Node Information window. Under the Protocol drop-down menu, you can select from a list of device drivers, such as Modbus RTU. Alarms are also a feature in MapWare 7000. Alarms can be displayed on screen in an alarm display object. To configure an alarm, set the tag that you want to monitor and set the condition that triggers the alarm. You can use a constant or dynamic condition based on the value of a tag. An email can be configured to send when an alarm is triggered. Mapware 7000 features data logging and can display log data through trend displays. The data logging feature can be set up to log to internal memory or external memory such as an SD card or USB drive. Different logging modes can be selected such as periodic logging or event-based logging. Individual tags can be selected and added to the data logger. The data log can also be exported as a CSV file. If you have other languages installed on your PC, you can add them to your MapWare 7000 application. Toggle between languages by changing the value in the language system register. The access level feature can provide restrictive access to specific screens. Create users and assign them a password and an access level. The access level for a screen can be set in the screen properties. This has been an overview of the many capabilities of the MapWare 7000 programming software for Maple Systems PLCs and HMI PLC combo units. Thank you for watching and check out maplesystems.com for more content.